Can we talk? Where are you right now? Where are you watching this video from and how does it make you feel? Do your surroundings fill you with inspiration and sunshine and excitement? Or do they make you depressed and make you feel like a big fat loser and make you think how the hell is it that I am still living in such a crappy place? Your surroundings greatly affect how you feel and how you feel greatly affects what you attract into your life. So it is very important to pay attention to your surroundings. This is why I stay in places like the one I'm staying in right now. The Trump Hotel in Soho, New York City. That's my view. That's my big fat king size bed that fits my gigantic king size body. The maid has not yet come. Relax, she's on her way. Here's the other view. And here is the bathroom. Check this place out. I used to live in apartments that were the size of this bathroom. There's the hidden toilet. Behind the mystery wall that you cannot see behind, but she's in there somewhere. Hello. Here's the shower. Note the gigantic shower head that is well taller than six foot one, which makes me a very happy camper. And here is the coupe de gras. I don't actually know what coupe de gras means, but this is the bathtub. Check this out. You feel like you're flying. So that's the um, view of the sunrise. It's the view of the city. That's the view of the sunset over the Hudson River. And those are the windows where perhaps some pervert with a pair of binoculars is watching me take my baths. Anyway, so I stay in places like this because looking out at these windows and staying in this kind of luxury makes me feel like I can seriously do anything. And I know there, there used to be a part of me that was like worried about feeling pretentious or hoity-toity, or whatever. I could give a crap about that anymore, quite honestly, because the difference that this kind of thing makes in my life is so profound. I mean, I attract completely different clients. I go about my life totally differently because I feel fancy and I feel like I can do anything. I mean, believe me, I could easily be crashing on my friend's floor in the West Village on an air mattress, but I don't think I would have the same kind of experience here in New York if I was doing that. So. I understand that you may not be able to shell out the kind of cash to stay in a place like this right now, but wherever you're at, think about it. How do you feel when you walk up to your house? Do you, do you hear the Sanford and Son theme song going through your head? I mean, that was seriously the theme song to my entire life for a while. I mean, every time I got in my car, every time I pulled up to my house, it was pretty bad. And seriously, I would hear that song. It was stuck in my head all the time. Anyway, if that's what you're hearing, spruce it up. Get a paint job for your house. Put flowers around your house. Hang art that makes you feel really happy and powerful. Whatever it is, whatever you're looking at every single day is going to affect how you feel. So pay attention to it and get on it and upgrade it because you can change your environment and change your life because it changes your energy. All right. So that is today's tip. Now I am going to go take a bath. Did you hear that, pervert? I'm about to get in. Get ready. Alrighty. Have a good one. Talk to you later.